Okay guys, so this is a 45 degree leg press. So we're putting the emphasis on our quads. So our foot position is really important in this. We're gonna put our feet position a little bit closer than we generally would, just to try and put the stress and the emphasis onto the quads. So to get started, she'll do a full extension. And what she'll do here is she'll almost flare her knees out, which will allow the break at the hips. So it won't put so much stress onto the knees. So she'll take it down and she'll push it up. And all the time she's driving through the heels of her feet. So again, she's flaring her knees out and that's allowing her to break at the hips, which is removing any stress from the knee. Now a good way to see what depth you wanna come down on this is either to make sure that that part of the quad touches the tummy as it does, or by placing your hands across your chest onto your shoulders like that, and then bringing your knees down so they touch your elbows. And that's a great reference point to know that you've come down far enough because some people will only come down by three or four inches to, from here to there and they'll load the weight up so they think they're really strong, but really there's no benefit to the quads. The only thing that's benefiting is the ego. So again, up and down and every time she's pushing the weight through the heels of her feet. And finally, just to finish, if she grabs all the handles again, she'll get some reps going out. And they're really, really important. And the key element of this is never, ever, ever lock them legs. We've all seen the YouTube videos where the leg locks and it snaps. Please don't ever lock them legs. Keep the weight through the heels. Keep your knees pointing out over and take it up just before your knees lock to get enough emphasis onto the quads and to protect them knees. It's really, really important. Give me two more reps, Ash. Breathe out now. In as you go down, out as you go.